Okay, cybersecurity. It feels like we hear about it everywhere these days, right? You can't even scroll through the news anymore without seeing something about it. And it's not just big corporations either. Small businesses, individuals, everyone's feeling the heat. So, you know, if you're even remotely curious about maybe diving into this whole world, I think you're in the right place. We're doing a deep dive today into Marion Technical College's cybersecurity and networking degree program. We've got their program page pulled up right here. Yeah, great topic. And you're right. It seems like every other day there's some new vulnerability or new threat to worry about. But Marion Tech's program, yeah, that caught my eye too. Let's uh, let's see what they're offering. So the first thing I notice is that they offer both a two-year degree A and D, a certificate option. Yeah. That's pretty cool, right? It gives you some, I don't know, flexibility depending on like what your goals are. Absolutely. Yeah, the two-year degree sounds like it'd give you a really solid foundation in you know, the fundamentals. While the certificate, that kind of allows for a more, I don't know, targeted approach for somebody. Maybe like someone already working in IT who wants to specialize more in cybersecurity could benefit from that, you know? Totally. And they seem to get that, you know, hands-on experience is key. Yeah. Which makes sense because in cybersecurity, you need to know how to DO the stuff, not just read about it. Nuts. Exactly. Yeah. And they actually say that it's designed with small to medium sized networks in mind. That kind of stood out to me because it shows, you know, it tells me that they're really focused on equipping students with skills that they're going to use in the real world, working with businesses they're likely to actually encounter. Yeah, for sure. So with all these skills, what kind of like career paths are yeah. we talking about here? They actually list some pretty interesting options on here. They have cybersecurity analyst, network engineer, IT auditor. There's even something called a penetration tester which, I don't know, it sounds kind of intense. It does, doesn't it? Essentially, a penetration tester is like an ethical hacker, right? They're brought in to try to find weaknesses in a system before, you know, the bad guys do. It requires a deep understanding of how these security systems work and, uh, and just a real knack for creative problem solving, too. Wow, that's fascinating. But, you know, going back to what I was saying earlier, it's not just about, like, the tech skills, is it? They also emphasize critical thinking, communication, even ethics, which you don't always see in a more like tech focused program. And that's huge, yeah. Cybersecurity professionals often face really complex situations with, you know, serious ethical implications. Having that framework to navigate those challenges, that's invaluable, honestly. It's not just about what you can do, but what you should do. It really yeah. is, yeah. And speaking of being prepared for the real world, let's talk about those industry certifications. They mentioned those. They specifically call out CompTIA security, mm -hmm. which I know is like a pretty big deal in the IT world. It is. It's huge. It's well, like, yeah. you know, it's like a gold star that tells employers, you know, what you're doing, that you've got the skills to back it up. I bet having that on your resume gives graduates a real leg up in the job market. Oh, oh absolutely. And, you know, it's more than just a gold star. These certifications, they really prove to employers that you're not just, you know, learning this stuff in a vacuum. It shows that you've actually had your hands on the technology. You have the practical skills to actually hit the ground running. You totally. Know? Totally. Yeah. Anyone can say they know about cybersecurity. But a certification, that, like, proves it. Exactly. And you know what else? It's not just about preventing those attacks. They also touch on business impact analysis and uh, disaster recovery. Oh, right, right. So it's kind of like it's not just about stopping the bad guys. It's also knowing what to do if someone yeah. gets through. Exactly. Imagine, like, a ransomware attack that, you know, it just wow. cripples a company's entire, like, sales system right during the middle of their busiest season. Understanding the business impact in that scenario can help these professionals prioritize those recovery efforts and hopefully, you know, minimize the financial damage. Wow. Yeah, that's a really that's a really practical application. It really does sound like Marion Tech thought about, you know, the bigger picture when they were designing this program. They really did. They've clearly put a lot of thought into making sure that the curriculum lines up with what employers are actually looking for in the real world. You know, yeah. What um, what stands out to you most from all this? Honestly. It's, it's got to be the practicality of it all. The industry certifications, the focus on those real world skills, mm -hmm. and even just like that emphasis on understanding the why behind the technology. It's, it's pretty impressive. Honestly, it makes me, <laughs> I, I wish I had known about this kind of program back when I was figuring out my career path. You and me both. I was so <laughs> focused on, you know, the traditional four-year college route that I didn't even realize options like this existed back then. Right. It was all about got to get to a university, you know. Yeah. This, this just seems like such a direct route. 
into such a, you know, a growing field. And that's a great point. And that's really what this whole deep dive highlights, I think. It's so important to look beyond just the, you know, the title of a degree. You got to dig into the specifics, the curriculum, what kind of career support they offer. That's how you figure out if a program is really valuable or not. Yeah, for yeah. sure. Couldn't agree more. So, you know, for anyone listening, if any of this has piqued your interest, even if you're just a little curious about cybersecurity, whether you're just starting out, you're looking to level up in your career, Marion Tech definitely seems like it's worth at least checking out. Absolutely. They've clearly put a lot of thought into how to, you know, stay ahead of the curve in this, this field that's constantly evolving. Well said. Well said. And on that note, I think that about wraps up our deep dive into Marion Tech's cybersecurity and networking degree. Hopefully this has given you a little bit of a clearer picture of, you know, what they're offering and maybe even sparked some ideas for your own journey. Yeah. Remember, the best way to find the path that's right for you is to stay curious, keep asking those questions and never stop exploring. I love it. Until next time, happy learning. We'll catch you on the next deep dive. Honestly, it's the practicality of it all, the industry certifications, the focus on those real world skills and uh, that emphasis on understanding the why behind the technology. It's it's pretty impressive. Honestly, makes me kind of wish I had known about this kind of program back when I was figuring out my career path. All right, tell me about it. Right? It's all got to get to the university, you know. <laughs> but this seems like such a direct route into such a, you know, a growing field. And it's a good reminder that a four-year degree isn't the only path to a good career. Exactly. So for anyone listening, if any of this has piqued your interest, even if you're just a little curious about cybersecurity, whether you're just starting out, you're looking to level up in your career, Marion Tech definitely seems like it's worth at least checking out. Absolutely. They've clearly put a lot of thought into how to you know, stay ahead of the curve in this, this field that's constantly evolving. Well said. And on that note, I think that about wraps up our deep dives into Marion Tech's cybersecurity and networking degree. Mm. Hopefully this has given you a little bit of a clearer picture of you know what they're offering and maybe even sparked some ideas for your own journey. Definitely. And if you're considering a career in cybersecurity, remember, stay curious, keep learning, and never stop exploring those opportunities. I love it. Until next time, happy learning. We'll catch you on the next Deep Dive.